Did you know that over 70% of diesel engine wear happens during first startup in the morning and the first few minutes of operation before your engine reaches normal temperature? That's right. Those critical moments when you turn the key could be determining whether your engine lasts 80,000 miles or 300,000 miles. If you're like most diesel owners, you probably think starting your vehicle is as simple as turning the key and hitting the road. But there's a costly mistake that silently wrecks engines. So in this video, I'm about to show you the number one startup mistake that's costing diesel owners thousands in premature engine repairs. And more importantly, at the end, the simple steps you can take to avoid it completely. Here's what most people do wrong. They get in their diesel vehicle, turn the key, hear the engine fire up, and immediately put it in drive. Some don't even wait for the glow plug light to turn off. They think because the engine started, everything's good to go. Big mistake. When you do this, you're essentially asking your engine to perform at full capacity when it's completely unprepared. It's like asking a marathon runner to sprint before they've even stretched. Let me explain exactly what's happening inside your engine when you make this mistake. First, let's talk about oil circulation. When your diesel sits overnight, or even for just a few hours, the oil settles to the bottom of the engine. Your oil pump, bearings, pistons, and countless other moving parts are sitting there essentially dry. The moment you start that engine and immediately drive off, these metal components are grinding against each other with minimal lubrication. This creates microscopic metal particles that contaminate your oil and accelerate wear throughout your entire engine. But it gets worse. Diesel engines rely on compression to ignite fuel, which means they generate significantly more heat and pressure than gasoline engines. When you start driving immediately after starting, you're forcing cold, thick oil through your system while simultaneously demanding maximum performance. This creates a perfect storm of destruction that happens so gradually, you won't notice it until it's too late. Here's something most people don't realize. Diesel fuel contains paraffin wax that helps with lubrication and performance. When temperatures drop, this wax begins to crystallize and the fuel becomes more viscous, acting more like thick syrup than liquid. When you start your engine cold and immediately drive, you're asking your fuel system to pump this thickened fuel through tiny injector openings at high pressure. This puts enormous strain on your fuel pump, can damage your injectors, and leads to poor combustion that creates carbon buildup throughout your engine. Your engine's computer tries to compensate by running richer fuel mixtures and adjusting timing, but it's fighting an uphill battle when the engine isn't at proper operating temperature. So what's the right way to start your diesel? It's actually simpler than you might think. First, always wait for the glow plug light to turn off completely before starting. This usually takes anywhere from a few seconds to 15 seconds, depending on outside temperature and your specific vehicle. Once you start the engine, let it idle for at least 30 to 60 seconds, depending on the outside temperature. In very cold weather, you may need longer warm-up times. Here's the key part. When you do start driving, take it easy for the first few miles. Keep your RPMs low, under 2,500 revolutions per minute. Avoid heavy acceleration until your engine reaches normal operating temperature. This usually takes about 5 to 10 minutes of normal driving. Following this simple routine will literally add years to your engine's life. You'll notice better fuel economy, smoother operation, and significantly fewer repair bills. I've seen diesel engines with over 400,000 miles that still run like new because their owners followed proper startup procedures from day one. On the flip side, I've seen engines with less than 100,000 miles that needed major rebuilds because of poor startup habits. Your diesel engine is a significant investment, whether it's in a pickup truck, SUV, or car. Taking an extra minute or two during startup could save you thousands in repairs and give you hundreds of thousands of additional miles. If you find this video helpful, please don't forget to like and share.